What's up everybody, NFX here with a quick shot tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to talk about some issues that you may have with WAV files that, you're, that you want to use that are part of drum kits and loops and whatnot that you're downloading or buying from, from the internet or whatever. Now this isn't necessarily a problem that's common to all WAV files, but usually when a WAV file does not sound the same in the sample browser as it does in FL Studio sample channel, it's usually one of the three things I'm about to show you. So let's see a demonstration of the problem first. Here's, here's a, a good example. This particular kick drum is called K-Knock. And if we click on it in the browser, which is where my mouse is, we're going to hear what it sounds like. Sounds pretty good. Now if we throw this over into the pattern, drop it in there, and then I just tell it to play it right there and then I I hit play we'll hear what it sounds like obviously that sounded different does not sound like okay so why is that well the reason is that this the wave data has some extra settings in it that the sample browser does not use when it plays back the sample the sample channel does use these particular settings. So we need to go in and, and clear off these settings so that it sounds the same. Let's go into the channel settings by clicking on it. And make sure you're on the SMP tab or page. And then you want to go down to the time knob right here and right click on it and select none. Now if we do that, and, and you noticed, the time knob actually did change a little bit, and even the sample here looks a little different than it, it did prior to the reset. So let's go out and take a listen and see how that affected the sound. So now it does sound the same as the sample browser, but it repeated four times. Listen again. And the reason is problem number two that we're going to fix. And that is that if we look at the sample data down here, you can see these red lines. That indicates that there is a loop point, a loop start and a loop end. And we need to tell it not to use the loop points. And that setting happens to be convenient right on the same page right there. If it's lit up, it means it's using the loop points. We don't want it to do that. We'll click that it will not use the loop points anymore. Now now let's take a listen. Great. The next thing, I have a, a channel preloaded here to demonstrate this particular issue. If I bring this one up, and in the browser it sounds like this, and I'm going to tell it to play, same, same sample. I'm going to tell it to play. Let's hear what it sounds like. sounds different. Sounds deep and full there. Sounds higher and weak once we put it in here. That's problem number three. In order to fix that, uh, you can check the, you know, the time and the loop points if you need to. But if it still has a problem, go to your miscellaneous tab and go check the root note down here. And all you need to do is hit reset. And I can see this root note is set to C4. When I hit reset, it's going to reset it to C5, which is where it should be. And now when I hit play, it sounds just like in the sample browser. So there you go. Those are the three things you need to look for. Time knob reset, use loop point setting, and root note reset. Those three things are going to fix problems you have with your WAV files not sounding the same from the sample browser into the sampler channel within a pattern. So that's it for this tutorial, but before I go I want to tell you about Warbeats. Warbeats we have a good user forum community there, very friendly people. We have file areas with remakes, uh, other types of project files, user created project files, many drum kits, if you need drum kits, stop by. 
We have beat feedback system. You want feedback on your beats? Stop by. And a bunch of other stuff. Interviews, articles, etc. Chat room, all that stuff. So come by War Beats. See what we have to offer. See if, it, if it's uh, good for you or not. And in the meantime, this is NFX saying I'll catch you guys in the next tutorial.